Hi, my name is Kyle Davis, and welcome to a quick talk on how to create multi-region database replication with Redis Enterprise. We're going to quickly talk about the features that are key to this topic, then jump right in and show you how to do it. The ability to do inter-cluster replication between Redis Enterprise clusters is built into every cluster. It's on a per database level and doesn't cost any extra. You can easily subscribe one database to the source cluster's changes and then receive changes in real time. Many people use this feature to replicate for disaster recovery purposes, geolocated databases, accelerated read performance, as well as having a copy of their production data in a reporting or test database. Some even use it for upgrades. So let's jump in and see a simple example of how to set up intercluster replication with Redis Enterprise. I have two separate clusters as part of my demo. There are two databases, SourceDB1 on cluster one and TargetDB2 on cluster two. I'm running a benchmark tool on cluster one to illustrate the databases are still running during replication. You can see it in this window. The first thing I need is the replica of source URL. I'll get that from the configuration of source DB1, the database I want to replicate. I'll go to the database, click on it, then click the configuration tab. Then find the get replica of source URL. That'll bring up this window. I'll copy this information to the clipboard and then go over to the configuration of source DB2 on cluster two. I'll click on the target database, then the configuration tab, scroll to the bottom, click edit, tick the replica of box, click the plus sign, paste in my value, save the value, go and click update. Now we're replicating from source DB1 to target DB2. Let's go and try it out. We'll log into source DB1 in Redis CLI and then set a key. Let's do set test one, two, one, two, three, four, five. Okay, now I'll go over to Redis CLI connected to target DB2. I'll do git test one, and we see I have one, two, three, four, five. Any object put into source DB1 will be immediately replicated over to target DB2. As you saw, it's very simple to get going as well as manage over the long term for real time replication with replica of in Redis Enterprise. No extra software is needed to make this feature work.